and welcome. This is Nasreen Sheikh and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. Rainfall eases in Kerala. Red alert removed Pune records 33 mm of rain in 21 hours. The India Meteorological Department has removed the red alert it had issued for five districts of Kerala today. The weather agency had previously declared alerts indicating extremely heavy rain for Inakulam, Iduki, Trishur, Palakkar and Malapuram and orange alerts indicating heavy to very heavy rain for eight other districts. However, as rain across the state slowed down on Monday, the forecast has now been revised at present. There is an orange level alert for Iduki district only. However, educational institution will remain shut on Tuesday in Alapuza, Erakulam, Trishur and Tiruvantapuram district as a precautionary measure. Following intense rainfall on Sunday and weather logging on Monday, the government began evacuating people from their homes. National Disaster Response Force personnel have been deployed in Irakulam, Alapuza column and five more NDRF teams have been served by the state government for rescue operations. 2,809 people have been evacuated and moved into 17 relief camps. The most number of camps have been opened in Irakulam while there are three in column district and one each in Kotayam, Alapuza and Palakkar. The rainfall over the past few days was caused by a threatening low-pressure region in the East Central Arabian Sea, which is likely to turn into a depression by Wednesday and move north eastwards. Pune in Madhya Maharashtra observed moderate rain and thunder shower activities amidst Maharashtra Legislative Assembly election yesterday. And in a spam of 21 hours from 8.30 a.m. on Monday, the city has received 33 mm of rain. In fact, good rains have been flashing Madhya Maharashtra, including Pune, for the last four days. A significant drop in the temperature was also seen as a result of these rains, leading to cool weather conditions. The weathermen at SkyMed have predicted more on and off rains for the city for the past two to three days, for example, until October 24. Thereafter, rains will take a break seat and dry weather would take over the region. The well-marked low-pressure area in the East Central Arabian Sea was responsible for the weather activities until now over Maharashtra. The system, however, would now move away from the coast in northeast direction. As a result, rain would reduce over many parts of Maharashtra. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Nasreen Sheikh. For more weather updates, do like, share and subscribe our channel.